To the latest trend in manscaping, Ron, listen up. This is a new business that's offering pampering in a quote-unquote man cave environment. So the burning question this morning, will guys be rushing to have their cuticles clipped? ABC's Rob Nelson went deep <laughs> undercover. That's not Rob right there. That is not Rob, but Rob is sitting right here, and yes. he went deep undercover for this story. He took it very seriously. Deep undercover. I'm keep going for that Emmy, man. I was going for that <laughs> Emmy. <laughs> now, when you think of salons, I'm guessing that punching bags and glasses of scotch don't immediately come to mind, but thanks to man-minded entrepreneurs from coast to coast, the world of manis and petties isn't just for the ladies anymore. Today, this Los Angeles store puts a new twist on the man cave. Punching bags, car parts on the wall, big leather chairs, testosterone central for sure, complete with Manny Petties. With the beer and the nice TV and the headphones and these huge king chairs, it's um, definitely a great place to relax for guys, I think. The store, Hammer and Nails, will officially open its doors today, catering to the modern guy looking to put the man back in manicure. This salon is obviously made for guys, and I feel a lot more... Um, not only at home here, but a lot more comfortable. That's right. These days, more and more fellas are retreating to caves of a much more plush and pampering, excuse me, mampering nature. The same ball players that used to wear jeans and sneaks to the games are now stylish and well-groomed. It's becoming more and more acceptable for a guy to be well-groomed. This new brand of macho is a growing trend that also stretches here to New York, where I got a taste of the action. Reluctance eventually giving way to relaxation. You've got girls doing your nails, you're drinking beer on Friday, I mean, I think it's a, I think it's a pretty much a no-brainer. This was far from my typical Friday night, but after a few cold ones yeah, salute. and some friendly chatter. I mean, when you first started, how bad was it? On you, not bad, oh, not baby. bad. This redefined man cave, yeah, I can get used to this. <laughs> now, the services at these man caves do run the gamut, including haircuts, scalp massages, and also shaves. And here's one behind-the-scenes tidbit from the staff I met there yesterday. They said, generally speaking, men's feet are in better condition than women's feet uh -huh. because those high heels guys do mm. so they much know. damage, yeah. Ginger yeah. Bianca. Yeah. yeah. Show off those nails. Let me see. They didn't, we, we were a little rushed <laughs> yesterday, so it wasn't not my as shiny as I need to be. But it was very good. I met, met a new friend. Yeah. You know, we had threw back some cold ones. Not, I've had worse assignments. You're looking smooth there, yeah. very mm -hmm. smooth. And I like the way you do jazz hands showing off your nails. That was nice. <laughs> this, could be, this could be the next bachelor party destination. I'm seeing it. Maybe no. I won't hold yeah. my breath. <laughs> I'll be in Vegas. Would you have fun at this? If one? anybody wants Bianca to plan their bachelor party, send us a tweet. GMA. Sounds awesome. Awesome.